Oh, she. Uh, I just wanted to say real quick, like you know, uh, you know, I got all these uh, wicked pagan. It's all in the same book, you know. I'd been there and heard the the been in that stuff, and I heard the same arguments, same lies, same trying to, uh, same old, same old trying to defend. So, you know, talk down, use educated words. Look at this, look at that, blah blah blah, and all this. And he tried to tell you that the de the the spirits and things they talk to is not evil, and they do good. No, they're not. That's a lie. You know, but they'll use that for beginners. But once they can get them in there and keep them in there for good, oh, that's when the real nitty gritty comes out. They call them demons, devils, gods, false gods, and stuff. They call them how to ev invoke uh, these spirits and demons. They even teach them, and if they don't do bad, I mean, like there is such thing as a good spell and a bad spell, which is a contradiction. I've been in that stuff, and I got wise, and I quit because seeing the evil that was in it wasn't good at all. And <laughs> But... Anyway, uh, to make a long story short, don't be fooled by these people. Now, they want to go back and forth and do a debate, try to prove that they're right, and, you know, look at the uneducated hillbilly Indian, you know, let's let's make a fool out of him, let's, let's make ourselves look good. You've seen some of the stuff the way they do the other brothers and sisters on their videos and stuff. You've seen uh, the way they've done them. Same way, they talk down to them, try to... Use the education and stuff. Oh, you're so beneath me. Mm. Well, I got news for them. Uh, they need to go to my video. Uh, Mr. Running Wolf is angry. There I go. I'm angry. <laughs> uh, Mr. Running Wolf is angry. They need to go to that one. I have some set rules. And I still follow that. Okay, and if they think I'm going to debate them, they're wrong. I will not debate anybody. Now, if any of my brothers and sisters who feel led to do so, I I say, here they are. Go at them. But you better be in the Lord. You better be in the Lord when you do. But I, I'll say this with these people. You know, I have my little joke, you know, because they was talking down to me, so I started just going, the. You know, like, hey, I'm just such a dumb hillbilly. You know, I'm just dumb. Uh, you know, but as far as ever wanting to get even with these people, nah. In fact, I want them to come to know the light of Jesus Christ. But unless Jesus reveals himself to them, they're not going to see it. There's two choices there. They either continue on the path they're on or turn to Jesus. One is death. One is life. Jesus is life. Do I want to force them to accept Christianity? No. Would I like to see them to embrace it? Yes. I sure would. But I am not going to do it with debate. I can do it with prayer. Prayer is better than debating. See, they can lie to everyone, fool them, but they can't fool me. They can't fool some of you. Are a lot of you out there out of the camp full. Now, some of the younger people and other people who just out there searching, doing that hippie thing, you know, which I think a lot of us had been at that point where you're out trying to find yourself. Now, they can fool them by lying and, 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 and think I'm stupid enough to believe that, you know, even after been in all that. And then they went, Well, what order were you in? Blah, 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 blah. What was your order? Well, I got news for them. You know, I had once been, you know, in that, and I've looked at their books, and I and I sit there and did everything that they 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 you know that they say you know to do you know to do blah blah blah, call on this do this ritual blue blue blue. Tell you what, it didn't do nothing. But these people will lie to themselves. I've sat there and seen people that do that. And finally, some of them got smart and realized there wasn't nothing there. And some, they never learn. They're just, or it takes longer. So anyway, uh, the point is, you know, they sit there and they uh, try to talk down to people and try to defend their position 
and it's kind of like come on do, would you want to debate the devil really I don't think I'd even want to go there. I don't even think I could you know handle that it's like see the apostles didn't make a habit of going around debating everybody you know now they had problems you know like now Paul he would uh, I guess we could call that a little bit of debate you know what he did but he didn't make a, a habit going around to uh, he didn't argue and fight and fuss with uh, Gentiles the ones he usually was in with those who were uh, believed in the same God now uh, uh, pagans, they don't believe in the same God we do. They believe in the one that got kicked out. All right, they believe in his lies, his tricks, follows his laws, which is do as you want, do as you will. And and they got all this stuff about spells they don't do they don't they got good spells that's a contradiction that's an oxymoron hey I said an educated word but anyway look no one wants to go there but my advice for those who've already started it some of them will stop and look at those books. And you go back and you look at those spells again and look, you know, if you're already in that, I'm talking to you who just started. You go back and you look in there and see about those little spells and stuff that they got in there and who they're calling on. That ain't no friendly thing that you're calling on, I'm telling you. And there's people that in Satanism can sit there and, and, and that it came out of that can tell you it's all of the same thing. It's all evil. I'm telling you. Now, either you can listen or not. It's your choice. You want to follow that same path? That is your choice. But if you want truth, you go to Jesus Christ. You don't rely on man. You go to Jesus Christ for truth. You don't go to the, the, this, this stuff because you, you're, messing, you're messing with things you, you have no control over and they'll end up controlling you. You got people that's full of demons are being controlled by demons, not necessarily uh, possessed. Some are possessed. Some are controlled by them. And, and a lot of you make fun and make jokes and you try, you know, and there's no doubt you'll try to try to make me look like the oddball, which uh, that usually happens with people who don't believe. And... And Christians, especially me, being accused of being a bigot. Well, let's put it this way. Just because you call me a bigot, don't make it so. Uh, in fact, I kind of laugh at that one. That, that, that's kind of funny. You don't know nothing about me. But the thing is, here's the deal. Anyone who wants to think that I'm going to debate them on anything, period, doesn't matter. I don't care if you're, you're a Christian trying to debate uh, your false beliefs or, or whatever, your your doctrine or whatever, I'm not going to debate nobody. I'm not going to start. I'm not going to start debating with them. I wouldn't even, when I was following my native traditions, okay, I would not get into debates with any of my peoples or any of the other peoples, like whether, whether if they was a, uh, uh, you know, Navajo, or if they was Hopi, or if they were N Lakota, or Dakota, or any of them. I would not debate none of them on anything. I didn't get involved in their politics or nothing. And I will tell you right now, I will not debate. Talk to you? Yeah. Debate you? No. But that's what they want, is a debate, a challenge, and I'm not giving it to them. But I'm leaving that to my brothers and sisters in Christ. If the Lord, if the Lord leads you to it, then there they are. Debate with them. If God leads you to do it, but be sure the Lord has led you to do it. All right. This is my thoughts. This is my feelings, and this is the way I feel about it. I don't want to get into all that other. Shalom and ha ho.